Thing to make you smile. Oh, that looks good. That looks great. Oh, y'all like y'all like the serious face, huh? You like the serious face? You like when I smile? Or you like the serious face? I put a little bit more effort into that serious face, huh? Yeah, let's go. Cuzzo and I am back with another bang. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the little bell notification so you can be notified when your favorite cuzzo post another video. All my cuzzo G's, it is Friday again. Sheesh, boy, we are one of the chosen, and I want to say thank you. If you are new to this channel, this is what we do. Drop the beat. We made it through the week. Ay, we made it through the week. Ay, it's Friday. I'm fit to turn it up. It's Friday. I'm fit to turn it up. We made it through the week. Happy freaking Friday. You said it. Grace, mercy, me, you, favor, baby. What he keep doing for us is truly impeccable. What we have prepared for us is some good old lobster tails, some eggs, some corn, and some sauce. Y'all already know the vibes. I cook these summer guns to perfection. It's a vlog fit to come out on them. You already know the vibes. Let me get a thumbnail with the lobsters at least. That'll do it. Hit you with that fla flavors by dang dash thumbnail. Before we get into this good old bite, let's go ahead and... That is ugly. Now that was just pretty, Ash. That was just pretty. Before we get into this good old... But let's go ahead and get this spread, cuz white hair. God, thank you so much once again for the food that you have prepared before my body, Lord God. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for restoration. Thank you for a peace of mind, Lord God. Thank you for deliverance. I know we're not perfect, Lord God, but thank you for loving our heart. We want to say thank you. We're gonna fall go we're gonna fall short of your glory, Lord God. You're the only one that is perfect here. So I'll step aside and let you do whatever you decide to do in my life, Lord God, as I always have. I want to say thank you for what you continuously do, Lord God. Man, you are so wonderful to be praised. As far as my subscribers, Lord God, whoever watched this video, let them be blessed. Let them know that the burden was never theirs to begin with. So we cast them all on you because you told us they were never ours. As for me, no nerves, no anxiety. Just let it flow. Just let it flow. Remove all the anxiety, Lord. Just let it flow. Just let this video flow. I know sometimes I could just be ahead of myself. I could be ahead of you, Lord God, but I just ask you to come in and give me patience and just do what you decide to do. In your name, I pray. Amen. have to start with the little cucumbers because what they have been to me these last few days has truly been remarkable i think we can all over we doing it sauce pie cucumbers pie let me give me a piece of corn i don't know everything's still hot too boy 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 we doing it Oh wow. Oh wow. These are actually two different sauces. When you watch the vlog, you'll see I cooked the lobster tails and some. And then this is the one that Rena made for me. So this is kind of like a garlic butter one. But you'll watch the vlog and see how I made this. But this sauce right here, I could have just probably ate it. Y'all be wondering. Y'all be saying I'll be keeping my shirts clean. I don't know how. We doing it. Damn. Baby. For that corn not to be fresh. For that corn not to be fresh, that is good. This sauce is spicy. <laughs> Sorry. I'm listen, I've told y'all I was gonna stop cursing. I'm working on it, I promise. Thank you, promise, guys. 
I could have just had this little boodoo for this boodoo. And I'm on both sauces. This one hotter. Mm. I gotta make a decision on, on which one I like. I don't have to. I want to. But this one doesn't have any onions and it has garlic. That's my whole yolk foot. I didn't bring nobody a spoon. I just be doing it. Come on, hit me. This one's more garlicky. This one's more flavorful. Both of them have flavor though. But they fine. I can't make no decisions. No, can I? They both good. Yeah. Oh, that's cucumbers, bevel. That one. This is crazy. I'm gonna say thank y'all. If it wasn't for you, baby, I couldn't afford this. No, I've been telling y'all that for years. Well, let these things be done. I've never cooked these this way in my entire life. I'm about to make a mess. Wonder if you're watching this, wonder. I'm about to make a mess. I'm gonna do it. I have to see it through though. Just cut it down the middle. Hit it with a little bit of And it's, I used some of that Simply Case of my own seasoning. And that was it. I really didn't season them too much because I already knew that I was gonna have sauce with them. And I don't, I don't like when it overpowers. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. Don't overcook them, Ash. You know, overcook the lobster. These on sale. It was. But I caught seafood on sale all week. You hear me? I gotta get that little part. Cause, baby, these were $6.99 for the product. We know that. <clears throat> the meal's been milling. They've been milling. Tamara. See, Tamara, I know you're here. I know you're here, Tamara. I know it. I appreciate you, my love. But I've never, like, sauteed them like this ever, to be honest. I always cook them in an the air fryer, but to be honest, look at that little tail meat, baby. To be honest, this way, it's, like, really good. I don't touch my shirt right now, but bruh, this is really good. I've never cooked lobster sales this way. I don't think I'll ever cook lobster sales that other way again. That has so much. Let me think I got some power in it. Mm. Me and my mama. What a treat. Gonna, I'm gonna ask for a better meal. No, I could not have. Could not have asked for a better meal, baby. We don't. This one right here is just so full of garlic. So full of garlic. I think I think I think this is the messiest <laughs> the messiest mukbang I've ever did in my life and it's worth it a lot of people always ask me how do I keep my shirts clean I don't let you know sometimes I don't but on a regular day I don't know yeah I just messed this one up on a, <clears throat> on a regular day Baby, these sauces is saucing. On a regular day, I just, I just eat. It don't even bother me. I done messed up so many shirts during seafood balls. That's why I just make them. I don't have no regular clothes. Because every time I get something nice, look at that. 
Simply case of my own seasoning, go crazy. That's it. That is it. That's all I season the lobsters with. But every time I get something nice, I want to wear it in the video. You know, I like to look nice in the videos. I like to <laughs> dress it up and make it look nice for you. But I ruin them every time. Every single time I do. And then when I be having to go on dates and stuff with my girl, I always got to go to the store and buy something to wear. I'm going to make me a little concoction here. I feel like it's going to be good. I'm going to make a little concoction. I'm just do it that like that. The concoction for the badoop. For the badoop. It can't hurt nothing. That was actually nice. I gotta do that again. But yeah, I always have to get a shirt for when I go somewhere, when I'm doing something. And then, I got this shirt the other night. And Rena had one out with some of her friends. And I, got, I went and got this shirt the other night. Then, boom. Guess what I'm doing in the video? And guess what I got on it? Seafood sauce. Baby, you can't tell me fat, meat, greasy, hard headed. If y'all seen that vlog today, you know how hard headed I am. We doing it. It's just a little concoction. I concoct it. You want me? You good? I bet. Mm. That was good. What's well, a shame is how many napkins I'm going through. This is the messiest. This is the messiest seafood bowl I've ever done. I am sure. Don't go too far. Not yet. No, you shall not. I have a surprise for you. What's it do? You know what, Rita? She goes up in there and drinks out of them and see which one she likes. I tell you what. I'm glad we swapped saliva. We are, anyway, we are doing it. You ready? You ready, Shannon? Shannon, you ready? Let's do it. You ready? So I'm gonna fizz up like a Jack and Coke. I ain't done. <sighs> oh, that was good. That orange mango is is good. I need me another piece of corn. Cause hold on, I gotta give me some more corn, baby. I can do without them eggs. I'm gonna give me another piece of corn, huh? Had to give me another piece of corn. This corn is probably the best thing I've ever had. I, I don't know. I told y'all this sauce right here got a hold on me. Probably probably because I'm not used to it. But this sauce right here got a hold on me. I'm about to mix them in a minute. Now why? Mm. I'm truly, truly satisfied. Okay, I, I'm, come on. I get the difference in the sauces. One is sweet and one isn't. Mm, this one isn't. This one got crab oil in it. This one got crab oil in it. This one is sweet. Full of onions. This is the one. Enjoy the meal today. Mm -hmm. I wish I could share this with you. Every time I eat something good like this, of this caliber, I always wish I could share it with you because I do. I do, man. Just post it. Just posted a vlog, literally. <laughs> now look at the thumbnail on this freaking vlog. Your favorite cousin ain't got no sense. Look at the thumbnail. Baby, I don't gotta even try to get no thumbnail. I was just like, you know what? That thumbnail was cute. It's just called sorry. Actually. I'll give y'all an update on what happened with the shoes. I'm sure I will. You'll probably see the vlog. I don't know when that vlog gonna drop on an update of the shoes. Because if you notice, I was not supposed to go to the shoe store. I went. I did it. I'm paying for it. She know. She know. But you gotta wait for the vlog to know how she found out. But look! Happy freaking Friday, my love. Man, to be here with you, it's a blessing. To be here with you every day, it's a blessing. 
It is, man. Um, somebody asked me my decision to stop cursing. I'm human. I'm an adult. I cuss on my live streams. I'm not even gonna cap to you and say that I'm perfect. I'm not. But as far as mukbangs, I was at. We were riding around the other day. We were in Grand Prairie. We were riding around. We had went stopped at this Oriental market, and I got out of the car and I heard the kids say, "Oh my God, that's that's cousin AB. Oh my God, that's cousin AB." And I think I had said, I don't know. I was I was saying something, but I had said um, the F word, and the um, the kid was like, "Oh my God, she curses." And I was like, okay, yeah, okay, okay. I'm not, I'm not trying to be anybody's role model. I'm not. But the least I can do is have a little respect. You know what I'm saying? No, that's the least that I can do. But, and then it's aligning with my purpose. What if that's not my purpose to what I'm, God is allowing, aligning me to do on this channel. So I just, I just made the decision. That's how we made this decision, baby. Not even last long, so y'all pray for me the good ones. But yeah, hearing a kid say that was kind of like, oh man, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not my job to be anybody's role model, but it is my responsibility to make sure everybody around me is being respected. That's just how I feel about it. And I wasn't even like cursing at nobody. I wasn't even like cursing. I think I was just talking to Rena, and I was like, something S H I T. Like you know, you just saying on a regular, just a conversation. But then that's when I realized like. It's okay to be respectful. Be respectful, you know, you know, and watch your surroundings. And you also got to understand that when, when you're in a position, everything attached to you is in that, you know what I'm saying? No, like everything attached to you. So in my mind, I want everything attached to me to win. So I'm, I'm not going to put anybody in no situation where they have to defend me. I try to anyway, but long story short, yeah, that was my decision to just stop cursing. But... Y'all got a plan. He always does, man. Like, I don't even stress about stuff no more because I don't. I just kind of be like, you know what? Forget it. I'm not. I can't please everybody. I can't. I cannot please everybody. I get messages every day. I get text messages saying, do this. Do this. You should do this. Oh, my God. You should do this. I, I'm. This is my best. You know what I'm saying? No, like, this is my best. And like I tell y'all all the time, if that's your best for that day, then that's all you could do. That's it. It's okay. Like, you don't have to be red carpet ready every single freaking day that gets to be exhausting you don't have to be a people pleaser every single day that becomes exhausting just be who you were designed to be if that's your best for that day then that's just what it is i'm not gonna play i said i ran that all the time just like babe listen you ain't gotta be perfect for me if this is your best and i say that i love you then i have to accept you when it's just not your best day but to me i'm gonna make sure i'm gonna tell you it's your best day you did good today you know what I'm saying? And that's another thing too. Just encouraging people around you. You never know what anybody is going through, man. Like you just never know what people are going through. While they're smiling on camera. You see them smiling on Instagram. You don't know their battles that they're facing. You just don't know people's battles. So if that's your best, lean on that. So for me, this is me. It's me. You know what I'm saying? Like I told y'all, people start hating you for the same things they started loving you for. I've been doing mukbangs for like three years. I started out doing mukbangs. Why, why would I? This is how. This is why a lot of people subscribed. You know what I'm saying? No, because at first of all, I'm cute or whatever. But you know what I'm saying? People subscribe because I, I do mukbangs. And now people are like, well, switch it up, change it. But I'm like, I just, good. No, this is my best. This is my best and I love it here. I love coming, pulling up on you, Edna, and my ride guys, pink and green, who say, man, I love you, I love you, I love you, Shara, I love you. It's too many of y'all name it. I, that's the ones that I am catering to. The ones that don't put an expectation on me. And I'm not going to put on one. TND. <laughs> TND. Man, Celeste Green, this is on my vlog channel, man. <laughs> um, Tam Kendrick said, been on the phone and you and KC connection with the YouTube must be tired of me. The ones that have a bit get black like, YouTube don't send nobody notifications. They don't. I don't. Official Jamil said, I don't know why the beat makes but the dog shaking, but I'm glad you fixed it. Dar I, man. Y'all are just baby girl 1000. Tasha P. Tasha P, you alright with me, dog. Like for real. Cassandra Benjamin. Mona Malik. Mary Todd. Like, that's who I'm catering to. I'm not catering to the ones who say you need to do this, you need to do that. No, man, my ride and die is pulling up and they loving me for me. That's the type of, I'm saying I got the best subscriber base on YouTube. I don't care what nobody say. Go tip attack with. I got the best 
Buy the best family on YouTube. Like, but that's the that's the people you want around you. The people who are not trying to make you change or trying to make you be somebody that you're not. That's if that ain't you, then why are you doing it? I was looking at people like, you look dumb. <laughs> this is a true story. I was looking at people like, you look dumb. That's not you. Like, that's not you. Like, why are you doing something that you don't even want to be doing? Was that cricket that whole time? Dang, show sure us. Why are you doing something that you don't even want to be doing? It's so, it's so many people out here full of pride, full of arrogance, full of greed, and full of all of these things. When you, man, listen. I don't do nothing you don't want to do and what I just that just made me remind remind me when I say people are full of pride it takes one phone call to man just could change a lot of situations they could you feel me it's a lot it's one phone call that could change a lot of situations a lot of tempos I'm not making them because maybe I, I read this too and I'm not like to share everything with y'all because man let me tell you why this just described me it did it but anyway it said somebody asked why do I stop talking to people without ex why do I stop talking to people with no explanation? Because people know exactly what they've done to me. I'm not about to address anything up to a grown adult. You moved how you moved and I moved out your way respectfully. Baby, if you don't see me hanging with nobody, if you don't see nobody with me, don't ask me about no damn body. Because baby, one thing about it, two things for certain. I ain't about to be nobody's pawn. No, I can't do it because... <laughs> baby, grown people know. I don't need to put... I got that on my shirt. I don't need you explaining. Uh, 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 I'm just saying, that's two different conversations, but... I ain't no need. Grown people know what they did to you, dog. They know when they moving funny. I got people right now probably mad at me because I, I peak peace. People probably mad at me because I peak peace. You know what I'm saying? Over their problems. Like, a lot of people, I like, I be thinking sometimes. Like, when people be falling out with me, because <laughs> I don't know, I don't know when people fall out, you know what I'm saying, with me because they, they don't call me. So, when people fall out with me, I just be wondering, you have just wonder like, what did I do? What was, what was that one thing that made you cut me off? Then I'd be like, I really don't give a damn. I, sorry. I really don't care. But for me, I feel like when I cut people off, and a grown person know what they did. They know what they said. They know how they moved. They know before. before. And then when you, you got a lot of people that's the common denominator in their BS. You, they be looking at you like, I ain't did nothing. So all they people wrong? Nah, man. Nah. Nah. Protect your peace. But I'm in a powerful place. I'm in a powerful place. I know it's powerful. I'm in a powerful place of peace. Just a peace, man. I'm telling you. I, I, I've been uncomfortable lately, but I've still been at peace. I've been uncomfortable, but I've still been at peace. Like, the way I'm living right now, I've been dreaming of this forever. Y'all been with me for three, four years. Like, y'all have seen me evolve in this place that I am in right now. Baby, don't come bother me. No, you're not. I said, sometimes I want to know what I did. Not all the time. Because most of the time, yo. But... This place of peace that I am in, I was just on, I was just on everybody, man. Everybody. When you, especially when you know you did right by people. When you know you did right by people, you had that sense of like, Lord, 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 it's in your hands now. It's, it's above me now. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you, you know you did right by people, but that's a lot of conversations that, man, people put their pride to the side, it can be fixed. Mm hmm Because I'm really like the type of person that like, if I did something to offend you, like, tell me. So I'll never do that again. Like, tell me. But some people, like, be like talking to a brick wall. You tell them what they did and they say, no, I didn't. How you don't? Okay, we're done here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But protect your peace. This powerful place that I am and, and, and this moment of, I know I've been isolated. I know I have been isolated. I know I have been isolated. It's okay. Isolate it to be elevated, man. Like, I don't have no burdens, no baggage. I don't have nothing. I don't. Everything that's been taken away from me, I feel like God replaced with peace. He did it. And I'm learning to accept not only where I am, but through the grace of God, where I'm going. And everybody can't go. I've had some stuff. If only y'all knew. Man, if only y'all knew. I had some stuff ripped from right under me. And I thought it was going to be mine forever. You know what I had to do? I had to get on this camera and say, Cool. Because with me, I'm not going I'm not gonna talk about nothing personal. Nah. Especially when I'm the only person that... I'm the only person on YouTube and the other person isn't here to defend themselves. I'm not. That's not. That's not me. No, that's not me. So, I walk away in peace. 
I walk away and then hold my head up high and say, man, whatever God, whatever you're doing this season for me, God, like, I, I, I gotta, I gotta respect it. You know what I'm saying? No, even if it hurts, but I don't know. I just be bumping my gongs. Happy freaking Friday. Have a safe and amazing weekend. Love y'all so much from the bottom of my heart. It's not only what's in you, what's in you, they could never take away. This is your favorite cousin. Is your favorite cousin. <laughs> you already know Nisha. You already know guys love it. Don't forget to drink with me. I love you, Nisha. Welcome to the shit show, ladies and gentlemen. Happy freaking Friday. I don't know. I be talking. My mom, I be like, hey, be like what, what was your video about today? I don't know. I don't know. And when I pray at the beginning, like, God, take away nerves, anxiety, and just let him have his way. I don't be knowing. I don't know. I just kind of wing it. I probably said something stupid. I, I don't know. That's what I try not to do. Mm, because baby Ashley don't. Mm. But <laughs> I try not to say anything stupid. But this is me. Flaws and all. Once you learn to accept yourself for where you are, that's a powerful place to be. Once you start accepting yourself for where you are, who you are, that's a powerful place to be. I'm not. I'm not anxious about where I'm going. I'm not anxious about where I've been. I'm. I'm accepting myself right now in this in this right here you know what i'm saying in, in this moment right here and there's a lot of people who have to get to re-know me and there's a lot of people who aren't going to get that opportunity at all because when i was going through this process of depression and i needed somebody kind of had to fight those battles by myself you know what i'm saying me and god like i know it's isolated but it's a lot of people that i just realized they can't go so it's a lot of people that's gonna have to get to re know me because the way I, me and God have rebirthed me, it's powerful. Like it's amazing. I'm happy. Like I feel like, oh, like a weight's been lifted. And I pray this on you. Like, pray this on you. But I'm finna go. I'm finna do it. I don't know about that boot. Girl, that, 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 I done washed this boot a thousand times. That's a nice boot. Cause if you can fit this boot, I'll give it to you. <laughs> if you can fit this boot, I'll give it to you. It's yours. Scratch free. If you can fit it, you can fit it. I'm not playing. I can't fit this boot. Nobody. Let's go. Let's get it.